Here's the kick. Going towards the far post line. This one right out of reach. That one will go in. Holy moly, Gardner Webb ties things up. And the free kick in midfield. The Eagles trying to retain. It's played upfield for Edwards. Plays it down from her chest. Trying to get through. Taken away. Demir C. Radford a 12-6 and 2 season in 2020. Looking to start a rally. Instantly ended. It's William and Mary. Excited about for Longwood along the back line. It was banged up to start the year. Uh, he almost had to go through Longwood's roster. Trying to work their way into the box. That they will. Headed out and away. Dehaven on the far side. She had Dibble cutting in. Looks to cross. Good use of the head from Demirsi. Long gone are the days of our of, of the wind sprints, Kylie. Yes, Th thankfully, <laughs> I don't think I would survive them at this. <laughs> and credit to Stephanie Lou for staying right in front of her. And making that save, not dropping the ball, and putting it at risk of a rebound goal. Pacelli has had herself some chances tonight, but has not quite been able to capitalize through just over 40 minutes of this one. Now 11 shots, five on target for the Spartans. Two total shots, just one on target that went into the back of the net for the go for Through Gossett, though. That's been really solid. Eight up the field, that's, that's well played. It's a great transition from Gardner-Webb. 
It's a lot of work from the forwards for Longwood to slow that play down. with three goals and three assists as an underclassman. Push to safety, but only for a little while. The move. Bouncing around in midfield, Ava Kurgate, sophomore for the Highlanders, as Gardner Webb takes their first possession, played back a. 